Can I ask you about one other issue, which is, I mean, I think people understand why Sinn Féin MPs will not take their seats at Westminster. You regard it as a foreign parliament and an imperial parliament and all the rest of it. And you've been very clear with voters, we will not take up our seats. But in these extraordinary and unusual circumstances, where things are absolutely on a pivot or a knife edge at Westminster, every vote counts. If you did take up your seats, you could have a huge influence on the course of Brexit and indeed on the course of events in Ireland. Are there any, is there any party that thinks maybe we should revisit this? Maybe we should think again about this? I, I don't accept your, your premise uh, that we would have uh, an influential effect. Seven votes, uh, I don't believe, well, would have that days. effect. And in, and in any event... I have no business, we have no business in your parliament. The parliament at Westminster, uh, correctly, uh, advances and protects what it regards to be British interests. That's the function of your parliament. We have no business interfering in that. I am Irish. We have not just one parliament, we actually have two parliaments on this island and our job is to advance and protect Irish interests. I have to also say this to you, I look at the experience of our, of our Scottish uh, colleagues and I see them at Westminster and there, there's more of them, I think there's 30 odd members uh, of Parliament from Scotland and I think they would readily attest to the fact that Westminster has no interest really in Scotland either, but by my observation. Westminster has never served Irish interests. It's not constituted or designed to do that. Right. Irish interests are defended in Dublin, in Belfast, and, and have been and Indeed. will be defended by our partners in the European Union.